Hello, you guys. So sorry for the lack of video last week. It was a heavy week with everything going on in Texas. I pushed all of my collabs off and quite frankly, just didn't have the energy or felt any bit decent about really being on social media other than to just express my sadness. I didn't, I wasn't able to just like turn it on. I'm never able to just turn it on for the camera. So I am sorry, but I hope you're excited for this video. I'm very excited because some of my earlier and most favorite YouTube videos I've ever done have all been pack with me's. And these are also some of my favorite videos to watch. It just gives me motivation to pack, inspiration on how to pack. Packing is, I have a love hate with it. I love packing and organizing and planning out my outfits. I hate trying to make everything fit and do I have enough? Do I have too much? It's a process and I feel like these videos help me to see them. So I hope that this provides some help for you if you need some inspo on how to pack efficiently or maybe some cute outfit ideas. So I'm filming this on my iPhone. I'm sitting on the floor. This is super impromptu. I had another video planned to do today, but I think this one just feels better and I'm more excited about it. So we'll push the other one off. But I had a spray tan today. I had micro needling done yesterday. So I'm bare faced. Um, I'm in black loose clothing. I'm not even wearing a bra because <laughs> I just had a spray tan. So we're just gonna wing this. Be all, oh natural. So one of my best friends from high school is finally getting married. Her and her fiance have three kids together. I feel like they've been married pretty much their entire relationship. It feels like at this point, the pandemic had caused them to postpone their wedding. It's in the Dominican Republic. And I'm so excited for this trip for so many reasons. I'm excited that they finally get to make it official. I'm excited that all of my best friends are gonna be there. I'm excited to go away with Dan alone without kids. I'm just very excited i need like i need a distraction from real life and just a vacation quite frankly so with that being said we are going to be there from saturday until tuesday obviously we have the wedding one day there's a white party one day i'm playing tennis for the first time so i'm just telling you all of this so you can see why i packed the way that i did i was thinking that dan and i could get into one suitcase together and i was successful you can't see it but all of my stuff is on this one side and I left him this whole empty side here, but he told me last night as we were packing that that's not gonna be enough room for him, which I'm not gonna argue. I would love to have one suitcase all to myself just for the little extras and what ifs and maybe you know I need a, two extra outfits for no reason. I'm not complaining, but I feel like it needs to be known that I was able to get all of my shit into one side of a suitcase. So with that being said, I'm going to kind of take everything out and show you everything that I packed. One thing that I really could have done without were sneakers and these take up a good space and some good weight. The only reason I'm bringing them is to play tennis. I literally text my friend and I was like, what do I wear to play tennis? Like I've never played tennis in my life. So had to bring the sneakers, but if I'm not bringing sneakers to work out on vacation, like I really don't want to have to bring them at all, but whatever. I have my curling iron thrown in here. I will link whatever I can do in the description box like this. I'll put a link to. I have also have some new jewelry to show you. This, it just came literally. UPS just dropped it. I haven't packed my jewelry little pouch yet. I feel like that's always last minute because I'm always, I wear a lot of it and then I'm just making a lot of changes, but I want to show you I'm bringing all of this jewelry. So I'll do a little quick unboxing with that. Okay, so I have the, I got the Stony Clover packing cubes from Target. There was three that came in a pack. I'm only using two in this one. These are obviously not available anymore. Stony Clover does have packing cubes on their website and I also really love the Cal Pack one. So I'll link both of them. But in this little yellow one, I have basically my undergarments, undies, bra, bras and then I normally would put like PJs in here but really I just packed like we're going to the Dominican Republic it's gonna be hot and so I just packed like bike shorts and tank tops for each night a black a blue and this hot yellow green color that is my favorite so I have all of that in one little guy here typically I always I swear by packing cubes you if you're here any any bit to see a packing video 
you know, or Instagram, um, packing cubes is the only way I pack. It's how I pack my kids. And the secret to really utilizing your packing cubes is rolling your clothes. So I roll and I fit and here's this one. So I'm going to pull everything out. So you get to see everything that I'm bringing and then hopefully you're following me on Instagram and you'll get to see me actually wearing this stuff. So, and again, I'll link whatever outfits I can find. I got this dress. I actually bought this to wear in Disney one day. It's one of their traveler dresses, but it has the pleated skirt. And what I love about these traveler dresses, I now have all of them. I have the black one that straps. I have the one shoulder. Those will be in my Disney. I think I'm going to do this again. If you guys like this video, I'll do a Disney pack with me. This one is pleated. So I thought that this would be really cute and appropriate for tennis. So we're going to fold that and just roll it up nice and tight like a burrito. I have two bathing suits. I just checked and I actually bought these to go to Mexico and then we ended up not taking that trip. So I think this exact color is sold out, but this style, the bikini and like the little bandeau, they're both from Good American, tons of colors. So I'll link that bathing suit here. And then I also have one here from Abercrombie. This one is one of those one shoulder like asymmetrical. It's going to be kind of hard to see it because I can't hold it up. It's a really pretty shimmery mocha. So it's like this. Okay, so that bathing suit's coming. Two cover-ups. This one is from Lulu's and it's really beautiful. It's long, it's really lightweight, and it's the shimmery gold metallic. I love these cover-ups because you can basically stick like a tank dress underneath or a bathing suit and just wear it as a dress too. Like it's great for a summer summer night or a vacation. And then I also got this cover up from Nasty Gal. It's crocheted, the whole back is open and then it ties and the sleeves are belled. And I got this to wear with one of my bathing suits. So these are my two cover ups. So excited about this top. I initially bought the one from Neiman Marcus, the designer brand. And I got the extra small, it's a lot wider and it was way too big on me and it was really expensive, which I didn't mind paying because it's a really nice quality brand, but then to pay to have it altered just seemed crazy. So my friend, I was telling my friend, she's like, I've seen them on so many websites. And so I started looking and sure enough, found this on Nasty Gal. It's a little bit more of a bandeau top, comes in other colors too. I initially bought this for their white party, but then decided against it because I found these bright colored i don't really wear a lot of color you know this but i feel like a vacation is a great excuse to bring in a lot of color so i got these bright orange trousers to wear with this top which i thought would be really fun this is a just a lounge around if we're gonna do some spa services it's a little bike short set from target so I have that in here and I have a bunch of dresses from Amazon, which I'm, I made a reel about these. I don't know if it's up already or you might see it at some point, but this is my favorite color blue, the cobalt blue. And these have, this dress has like little cutouts on the sides and it fits so good. It has a slit up the side. I got this for dinner one night for the white party. You guys would not even believe like how many white outfits I bought and dresses and I hated all of them and then I was like you know what let me just get this simple one just in case it's a backup and I ended up loving it the most so it's same thing from Amazon ribbed it has a cutout here and then a slit this dress comes in a lot of colors too but that's what I'm doing for the white party and then never did I think I was just talking to Colette about this my friend we went to get pedicures today Again, I had ordered so many dresses for this wedding beach wedding it's like do you go formal do you go casual do you go beach casual do you go comfortable do you go light like oh so i have been ordering and returning and trying on and ordering and returning for a long time and sure enough found this one on amazon thinking i would wear this for dinner one night when it came in i was like i'm gonna wear this for the wedding like this is a perfect dress for the wedding i love this color when do i ever get to wear a color like this especially for a wedding this is completely adjustable. You can like hike it up as high as you want, as much leg to show. This comes in lots of other colors and the material is so light. It's so stretchy. It's not going to like stick to you if you're sweaty and so easy and comfortable to move in. So I got that. And then one other cute little, I thought resort cute outfit. 
that I found on Amazon. Also comes in a bunch of colors. Are these little like gauzy pants that have a slit up the side here. And then there's a cute little top. And this comes in a bunch of colors too, but I love this burnt rusty orange. And that is literally all the clothes that I have in this packing This cube. is a shoe packing cube that I got on Amazon. I think it's supposedly, I don't know how many it's supposed to fit, but I fit a lot. So I have one pair here at the back. And then I don't want to undo it because I it's like a little puzzle that I was able to fit these all. I have three shoes here. So one pair. These are Amazon. And then these are Steve Madden. I think I'm wearing these for the wedding. So I have all three of these fit into this top layer. This is one thing I don't want to mess up because I don't know if I'll get it back. <laughs> then if I go onto the next layer... You still have like a slot here to fit them, but it will obviously will bulk up the whole thing. And then here I have a pair of gold metallic flats. I got these to go with bathing suits by the pool, the other one. And then I'm also bringing my Chanel Terry espadrilles that I love that I thought would be really cute with this outfit. So that is all in the shoe caddy. Now, moving on to handbags hold on i decided that i'm just gonna bring this as my carry-on on the airplane it's a big bucket bag i shared an unboxing of this if you missed it i'll link it below and then i'm pretty much putting all all a few my few handbags that i'm bringing in here because i have the room and i just don't trust that they won't get stolen out of my suitcase so the three bags i'm bringing are this neon one to go with cute little crossbody and then, of course, my Colt Gaia Nano. This will be, I don't know, either my wedding bag or wedding dress bag or my feathery top bag. I have options. And then I did order one other bag. It will be here tomorrow. I'll put a picture here, and that will be the bag that I take for the white party. That's going to go in here, too. I have the dust bag because when I put this on the ground in the airplane, I'm going to put it in the dust bag. Ugh. And then in here... I have, this is going to be like snacks for the airplane. This is a Sony Clover bag. I have my little oils pouch in here and my oils I always travel with. M grain for head, tummy, um, my deep relief for my back. I get like back spasms. Breathe again if I get like congested on the airplane. And um, Valor, which I use for anxiety, flying, you know. And then this is another Stony Clover pouch things. I have my portable charger. This isn't completely packed yet because I'm living out of this, like with a lot of stuff. I have my portable charger without the cord because I'm using the cord. These are my little like daily supplements, I guess you could say. I have my vitamin C, my vitamin D, my fish oil, and these little collagen capsules that I started taking in that. And then I have this other really pretty pill case in here. These are like my my medicine, my daily, I take for like my stomach IBS stuff. And then I have some Excedrin in here, in this little pill case. And then my passport, Dan's passport will be in here. My earbuds will be in here. I have them in my car right now and my wallet, obviously license, all that. So I'm not taking a laptop or anything. And this bag fits everything fine. I have this big, this is the large pouch from Stony Clover. And I'm pretty sure this is like a good 10 pounds because I have everything in here. I have pouches within pouches. I have these little clear ones from Amazon that I love. They're super inexpensive. I don't mind if they get dirty. They're easy to clean, but if anything spills or makeup gets on here, not a big deal. Um, body brush, face brushes, and a beauty blender. And I did bring more makeup than I normally would because I'm doing my friend's wedding. I'm doing my friend's makeup for her wedding. So I had to bring a lot of this stuff because we did like a trial when we went to her bachelorette. I'm bringing a lot of the makeup to use for her. Normally I wouldn't travel with this much makeup. But in this pouch, I have like my skincare. There's my toothbrushes in here, a hair tie, beauty blender, cleanser to clean my brushes and sponge. This is the body spray that I've been raving about. I use it in my hair. It's very complimentary of the Baccarat 540. This is a body tanner, like body sauce from Fenty, body lotion, my jewelry cleaning pen, and then all my little travel guys. I have a deodorant, 
a Laneige lip mask. I really don't love that product, if I'm being honest. I'm just using it because it's a travel size. The Elemis makeup remover, Origins eye cream, and then my pharmacy products, Feeling Good, and Honey Halo, and of course, my vitamin C from Ever. And then I am bringing, this is crazy, but two full-size bottles of perfume. I don't, I do have the little travel of the 540, but I don't have enough. I probably have like one or two sprays left, so I have to bring the whole body, the whole bottle. There's no way I'm not traveling with this. And then this is the Ginger Picante, which is just the best summer fragrance slash vacation fragrance, pool fragrance. It's so good and gingery. I think it's officially discontinued at this point. If I can find it anywhere, I will put it in a link in the description box. But every time I was sharing it on Instagram, like people would send me, oh, I found it here. I found it here. Every time I'd post it, it you guys would, they would sell it out. So if I can find it, I'll post it. But those are the two fragrances. And then the rest is just makeup. So I have my setting spray, mascara, which I have lash extensions, but I brought it just in case I want to put some on the bottom. My eye primer, face primer, my Avene Compact SPF 50. This is a cream. I share and talk about this product a lot on Instagram with my Intella shade, which is all I'm wearing on my face right now. It's a tinted um, sunscreen, and this is probably all I'm gonna wear for day to day, like by the pool. I'm not gonna put makeup on. And then for the wedding and for night, um, this is what I will be using. I also had Sidette, my friend, get the same one, but in her color. This is gonna be her wedding foundation. Translucent powder. My color science this is also sunscreen for your eyes and an eye brightener. I have two correctors for my melasma and Syed has like a small little piece, um, satin scrunchie. The NARS Liquid Blush in Torrid is this um, for me and for her as well. When I did her trial makeup, I used this color on her. It's love. She has very similar coloring undertones as me, so it makes it really easy. But this is by Rare Beauty. The only shadow I'm bringing for me and what I use for her is the Darling Palette from Charlotte Tilbury. Go figure. Concealer, this is the Dior Forever. I am in the shade uh, 1N, and I had Sidette pick this up too, so this will be the concealer she's using. It's so good. And then to set and brighten under eyes well rested and summer bisque concealer from bare minerals this is a cream shadow if you guys follow me on instagram which i think most of you do at this point none of this makeup is going to be a shock it's my favorite makeup you know me like i'm loyal i don't waver i like to try new products here and there but like as a whole my makeup doesn't change so all of this is like shared and linked and obsessed over on my Instagram, but this is nearly neutral, which is a liquid shadow. And it goes so pretty underneath these colors in this palette. And then for a liquid bronze or cream bronzer, I'm bringing two, the contour wand from Charlotte Tilbury. And I've been mixing it with the candlelight drops from Cover FX. In the summertime, I love these drops. You can mix them in with your foundation too. This one's like the more bronzy one. So it just gives you that like gorgeous sunlit glow. And then the last thing I have in here is my Color Wow, which I use to do my hair. I need to pick up a travel shampoo and conditioner at Sephora tomorrow, hopefully. And what else? I didn't include my lip products in here because they will be minimal and the ones that I'm taking are in my purse. So other than that, that's all the makeup. And that is everything that I have packed so far. I wanna show you this jewelry though. I got this from the brand Atika. I paid for this, this is not sponsored, but I do have a discount code with them. If it's, I'm gonna put it in the description box. I don't know if it's still valid or not. Sometimes like give me a code and give me a gift card to pick stuff out. So when I picked stuff out the last time with them, I saw all of these other pieces and I like favorited them because I knew that they were so pretty for like a beach vacation or summertime. So when this trip was coming up, I was like, I need to go back and get those pieces of jewelry. So this brand is really beautiful. It's very good price points. And again, none, none of this is sponsored. Really nice quality jewelry. Comes packaged beautifully. These little satin dust bags. And let me show you. I'm so excited about all this stuff that I got. So I first got these earrings, which you know I love all things charms, especially earrings. Look how cute and colorful little pearls. I love the pops of color, the little like protective eye. There it is. A little daisy. I'm trying to show you. It's hard to see. It's just a little gold. 
nugget there. So I got these little dangles, which I thought were really pretty. Love this pearl necklace, which you know I love beach jewels. And these are pearls. It's a long chain and has like a little charm dangle that you can actually take off. But I thought this would be really pretty with like a bathing suit. Obviously not to go swimming in, but you know. And then these are kind of obnoxious and I love turquoise. Comes in a two pack little dangles. These are like mother of pearl with a little crystal. And you can mix and match. And then this I've never Oh, this is, <laughs> I hope this is not tangled. I've never ordered one of these, but these are becoming very trendy. This is a body chain. And the way that they have it here is I'm thinking so it doesn't get tangled, but it's a body chain. And it has, it's just like the most delicate, pretty little chain. There's some pave here in the middle and you wear this with your bathing suit and it's just jewelry for your body. And who doesn't love that sitting by the pool? at the beach so like I said I will put my discount code below I think I want to say it's 20% off I got all of this during their memorial day sale I think I got it all for like 35% off I need to pack all of this but oh wait what is this I think this is just a little extender that came with that okay so that's everything. Now I have to repack it all up, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to edit this right now, get it up for you. So it's right on time for Friday. Links to everything will be below. Follow me on Instagram so you will see all of this stuff on me. And hopefully you can follow along some of our fun at the wedding. I am so excited. <laughs> I hope you guys have a great Friday, a nice weekend, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.